bit of a shock. I didn't, I didn't really know who they were going to hire, honestly. I don't think anybody did. Um, but then, you know, you see all the stuff, all the excitement that he has, and all the love he has for the University of Kentucky. And it, it, it excites me. Um, to get to uh, have the opportunity to play for a like that. Um, you know, he, he's really excited. He's a lot of energy. And you can see here today. Uh, so it should be really fun. What was going through your mind when Cal ended up leaving and, and that all kind of transpired pretty quickly? Just what was your personal thoughts? And then, obviously, after the dust kind of settled after a couple of days, how were you thinking that? Yeah, so, yeah, you know, it's, it's obviously pretty crazy. A lot of you know, a lot of people thought that might never happen. Um, but, you know, the, the world of college basketball right now is is pretty crazy. It's just that. Um, it's, a, it's a tough business. There's a lot of a lot of changes, moving parts. Um, so, you know, it was just a little bit of trying to figure out what, what the situation was, what the steps were going to be moving forward. forward. Um, and just, just trying to get all the information. I'm surprised for you when you had to stand up. Very surprised. I did not expect that today. Uh, you know, 23,000 people in here. Um, about as loud as you possibly get. That's, that's pretty neat. That's that's a feeling you can't really replicate. You don't really know what you're doing in the moment. Honestly, you're just kind of taking it all in and, and hopefully trying to soak it in. So that's pretty incredible. How did this compare to the last time you were here when you winning a state championship about a month ago? I don't know. That's, that's pretty hard to top. Winning a state championship for, for the school like I played in Lyon County is, is, uh, is something that had never been done before. So to be able to do that, um, and with such a special group of guys, with my dad coaching us, um, that's a hard, hard feeling at the top. But this, this today, you know, the, the pack house for a press conference is, is pretty incredible. And then just to get to feel the, the warmth, the love, uh, the excitement in the air, it, it's pretty incredible as well. You knew there would be a crowd here. Did you expect this? I did not expect this. I, I never could have imagined it would have been capacity here today for, for a press conference. That's, that's something you can't expect. You know, it, it doesn't really happen. What's your message to the recruits who are going to be coming through the portal, coming out of high school, and being under uh, Mark Pope for the first time ever? Yeah, yeah, so just, just trying to you know, come in. Uh, the main thing is just the you way know, you want you want people, teammates, coaches, staff, uh, just everyone that's around you to be about winning. And that's the most important thing. That's something that, that I've always been about, that, uh, that I've always wanted to play with people that are about. Um, so that's the most important thing, just being about winning and about the right things. What was your first conversation like with him? I know you can't tell us everything, but what was that phone call like? The, the main thing of it was he was just super excited. You know, he was he was pretty much screaming whenever I, I answered the, the FaceTime. He was pretty much screaming, um, and then just just kind of uh, you know telling me he was excited about it, getting to know me, getting to getting to go through this. Um, and then uh, I told him he just told me to get the shoulder ready, get ready to shoot a lot of shots. I'm sure you were asked this at the beginning, but I missed it. Just what, what is your status right now with Kentucky? You're obviously signed. Is that still how you, how you plan on? Do you plan on joining the team this summer? Or what's the kind of thought process right now? Yes, sir. Ever, as of right now, I'm still signed. You know, obviously, um, haven't got to really sit down with Coach Pope, but uh, that's that's something that I want to do in the future. Like I said uh, today, he's gonna be very busy. You know, he, he might be busy for a week. That's just how it is in Kentucky. But uh, hopefully, get up here again sometime in the future. Uh, we get to have a conversation with him, kind of see see where things go from there.